Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Weekend with Rain Cane. I'm Brian, host of the show, co-founder of Rain Cane. Today we're making a caramel apple cocktail. I've never had this, never made it before. I'm pretty curious to find out how it's gonna be. It sounds good, so let's go ahead and get to the drink. Now, it's a really easy cocktail to make. It's basically two plus two equals caramel apple cocktail. Two ounces of rain cane and two ounces of cloudy apple cider and just a quarter ounce of caramel sauce. Of course, the sweeter you want your cocktail, the more caramel sauce you can put in there, the more caramel you want it. Nice car alarm for us. Add our ice and shake it. I'm gonna put some caramel sauce in my glass. See if I can do it like the people at Starbucks do it. All right. Well, <laughs> it's not the prettiest. It'll do. And strain it in there. Now it looks pretty. That looks so good. It has like a little bit of a frothiness to it too. That's cool. I think the two coolest apple garnishes are the kind where you cut it horizontally, so you get a star in the middle of your apple, or the apple fans. I'm gonna throw apple horizontal on there. So I just think that they look cool. Caramel apple cocktail, let's go ahead and give it a try. It's delicious. I'm just deciding if this is a, you know, beginning of Friendsgiving, beginning of Thanksgiving kind of cocktail, or if this is a dessert cocktail. It kind of plays that fine line between the two because it's so sweet, but it's also really refreshing at the same time, so. Probably a before. I don't think it's quite sweet enough. Maybe, I mean, it just depends on how much caramel sauce you put in there, but. The way I made it, I'm gonna go with a before, a very exciting before dinner cocktail. So cheers to your weekend with rain cane. If you don't make this one, I hope that it at least inspires your drinks. I love it personally. So cheers, hope you guys enjoy it. See you guys next weekend.